इंस्पिरेशन फ्रॉम द स्पेशल सेशन Well, yes, in fact, Swati, and the opposition basically says that why exactly there was a need to call a special session when these bills could have been introduced in the parliament in the winter session. While the government says that they want to discuss on the 75 years of Indian Parliament, and the, at 11, we know for a fact that our Prime Minister Narendra Modi will initiate the discussion in the Lok Sabha and in Rajya Sabha. Piyush Goyal, who is the leader of the House, will be uh, starting the discussion from BJP in Rajya Sabha. What we are getting to know is that Lakshmi Pant Bajpai, other than Piyush Goyal, uh, Radha Mohan Das Agarwal, Sudanshu Trivedi, they all. Will be speaking from the BJP side. So the four speakers will be there from the BJP side: Piyush Goyal, Lakshmi Kant Bajpai, Radha Mohan Das Agarwal, and Sudanshu Trivedi. And we also know for a fact that our government has been saying that the opposition parties should welcome the step that a special session is being convened. The opposition should welcome uh, uh, the special session of the parliament. And we have already we have already informed to our uh, to uh, to the opposition parties that what exactly will be the agenda. Now we also know that how the right. India Block meeting will also take place. We also know that how uh, the BRR strategy. meeting will take place so today we can expect that uh, uh, there will be as you said uh, that uh, there will be uh, fireworks inside the parliament also they are expected that opposition has been raising the questions on the intent of the government they are questioning the intention of the government they are saying that there could be the hidden agenda of the government that could come out because they say that these bills could have been uh, introduced in the winter session there was no need to bring in the special session for it so the opposition again and again right. will raise this issue while the government will start a discussion with the prime minister at 11 and in Rajya Sabha Piyush Goyal will start the discussion back to you Right so you're saying there are four speakers four speakers okay okay stay on with us Mohit uh, we have some breaking inputs coming in as well now these parties of course are issuing whips and uh, Aam Aadmi Party has also issued whips to its MPs uh, puri attendance ke liye whip issue kiya jata hai sare sadasyon ko maujood rehna hoga jab karyawahi hogi we have sabse sachi getting us more details on the breaking input coming in sabse sachi tell us more about this breaking and the other developments taking place uh, aap has also issued a whip now Well, absolutely. See, AAP has uh, issued a whip, and uh, we have seen that from 10 in the morning, the opposition parties. Uh, meeting has been called in uh, inside the parliament to strategize and uh, the opposition parties the india bloc are fo focusing on the nine points that sonia gandhi has uh, mentioned in her letter now the opposition parties would be raising this issue inside the parliament and we have also seen that the opposition parties are coming together on the women reservation issue as well uh, several opposition leaders have demanded that the government should bring the women reservation bill in the parliament and talk on this and uh, meanwhile we have seen that the opposition parties have raised question on the intent right. as well as the timing of the spe uh, special session they have said that the government have cleared the agenda of 18th and 19th but they have right. not cleared the agenda of 28th uh, 21st and 22nd is the government hiding anything right. under they, this they think there is suspense on uh, the agenda of 28th 21st and 22nd and the opposition says that there is uh, you know something that is going to be sprung during this session 
distraction or surprise element which according to the opposition is the hidden agenda. Let me quickly go across to our guests. Mr. Raju Gopalan, uh, is it really about uh, the 75 years of parliament? Is it about the eight bills that the government is talking about? What is the actual agenda is what many are asking now ever since you know this word surprise element and a suspense has come up. Swati Narendra Modi means surprise. Whatever Narendra Modi does, he, he springs a surprise. My understanding is the five days are going to be Narendra Modi days because from colonial era to Bharatiyam, we are coming to old building to new building. And I am great pleasure. From 1977 onwards, I have covered that uh, old parliament. But my understanding, as you asked me very clearly, the surprise element is not women's bill. The surprise element is not that one nation, one pole. My understanding, yesterday the law ministry had a you know, top secret meeting. I understand they may go in for five or six union territories. That is going to be the major you know, revolution because we want to have development. After G20 and after many you know, important functions like Chandrayaan, Prime Minister and the government of India are keen to have Narendra Modi. You are Vajpayee sharing a very big scoop. You are wait, wait, it's wait. Not about one Swati, nation, wait. One Swati, wait. Hmm. Vajpayee created three states. Congress created. Second thing, Mr. Narendra Modi is going to give you five or six union territories because we have to develop, we have to compete. That is going to be the Amrit Kal. Okay, so no one nation, no, one No, uh, it, it is not confirmed. No India, Bharat. But according it to is, you, the big scoop is that there are going to be five or six new union territories. That is the bill is going to come on Wednesday or Thursday. Here they are going to float this because Jaise Abhi Dhup Me Khada Kar Diya Jo Taisim Ka Opposition Ka Aise Narendra Modi Ne Bhi Usko Dhup Me Khada Kar Diya. Taisim Buna Wala. Taisim Ko Dhup Me Parishram Karne Ki Aadat Se. Bhai, Sapka Blackout Karte Jao Rho, Black Dress Pane Ho. Taisim loves to fight in the in the in the in the tough situation that this country is going to a tough situation can you imagine in a session for amrit kal ask everyone here uh, in front of this amazing parliament ask your bjp ask ask ganshap ask raj gopalan ji nobody knows what the agenda is you are having a special session of parliament Bhai, agenda bolenge ye walk out karte ek swati ye walk out karte pradhan mantri ka badnam karte ye log sir ye log mil mil ko ne kala tan se aaye we walk out we do everything ye swati ji agenda swati is not the main thing bad let why does swati not I never interrupted, please. The point is, we are in Amrit Kal. Hmm. In Amrit Kal, a journalist like Swati and a journalist like Raj Gopal and Jia at Kale lagawing. They don't know what the what the what the what the uh, what the agenda is. That is the root of the problem. The root of the problem is hmm. surprise, master stroke, master stroke. Tomorrow morning, laptop ban, master stroke. Day after laptop allowed. Are you think things through? This is a country. You are not some king. You are one amongst equals. Hmm. How can you have a special session where the opposition does not know what's happening and yet a senior journalist like Raj Gopalanji who will cover me when I'm in parliament and the prime minister's leader of opposition okay. does or not know what's happening? Okay. Gansham Tiwari, the opposition after the all-party meeting says, we have just done a special session, we have just done a special session. Prahla Joshi has constantly been saying, we have put the agenda on the table. We told you there are going to be eight bills. We told you this is about the 75 years of the parliament. We will see what will happen. Good morning, Swati, to you, my co-panelists and the viewers, and uh, happy Ganesh Chaturthi to everyone out there. Three things are important. One, if you read the newspaper of, of any publication today, no one knows what the agenda is. The same newspapers will tell you that our Prime Minister has the worst record compared to other Prime Ministers in terms of number of sittings in the Parliament, number of debates, number of questions taken, and under his leadership, the current uh, Lok Sabha has the lowest record of number of sittings. That shows that this government has no trust in the Parliament. We often hear about the phrase mad scientist at work. We do not want a prime minister to be equated to that uh, phrase. Why should a prime minister uh, believe in his own maverick and keep a nation in dark? It's a cruel joke on the democracy. One final point. This government tom tom the agenda of chief election commission, mm. de demoting the role of chief election commissioner, de de demoting the designation of chief election commissioner. Mm. Not only do newspapers are critical about it, the government is also non-committal about its own standing. If a government who's going into election in 2024 okay. is, wants to turn the chief election commission's office into right. a rubber Ganshan stamp, Tiwari, I'll is take a quick rebuttal from, from Mr. Raju Gopalan. Then on CEC, we'll talk about what the Supreme Court said as well. But we have a reaction coming in from Adhiranjan Chaudhary. Let's listen it. Special session, what is the law of the law? What is the law of the law? क्योंकि स्पेशल सेशन के साथ साथ इतने सारे बिल पारित करने का क्यों मनसा सरकार की हुई है ये भी सरकार की तरफ से 
ये स्पष्टीकरण नहीं हुई कि स्पेशल सेशन का मतलब एक ही मुद्दे पे होना चाहिए अगर स्पेशल नहीं तो क्या है रेगुलर वो भी बोलते नहीं अगर रेगुलर हो तो हमारा क्वेश्चन आवर किधर गया हमारे जीरो आवर किधर गई उसका कैसे हम उपयोग करेंगे इसका कोई स्पष्टीकरण नहीं तो सारे मान लीजिए कि सारे मुद्दे सारे चीज़ों में अटपटा लग रहे हैं All right, we have some more breaking inputs coming in. We are given to understand that the MPs will be given a copy of the Constitution. और हर एक दिन क्या agenda रहेगा ये पहले ही स्पष्ट हो गया है। अब जानकारी मिल रही है कि जितने सांसद हैं सभी को Constitution की एक-एक प्रति दी जाएगी। You know, we are also, Mr. Rajgopal, let quickly come in because you've covered the old Parliament. You'll be covering the new Parliament as well. Quickly, you know, if you could talk about this transition from the old Parliament building to the new one, even that was marred by a lot of controversy. No, Swati, the technology has improved. You can't be backstabbing the technology. My understanding is Congress wanted to tell a chalta, a chalta, a chalta attitude. But Narendra Modi wanted to take a risk. You see in Delhi, he has created an amount of five or six tallest buildings. Like, you know, Pragati Maidan. Yesterday, we went, went to Dwaraka, that is one. Parliament House. Therefore, it is technology driven, artificial intelligence driven. That is why India is moving forward. That I is the main point how that Amit Khan, Congress of Paisa Karate, 2G, CWG, Paisa. Explain to the viewers of Times now, how is the new parliament artificially driven? I will tell you. You wait first. and see. Tomorrow, you can't hey, teach hey, the hey, game. Okay. Hey, okay. Hey, 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 राजगोपाल ने ब्रेक लेके आते हैं वापस